Welcome back to North of the Broad. Commodore Tank Morris is with us for the Buford Water Festival 2021. We are a go. That's here, what I understand, right? Here we Tank? go. We're we're <laughs> diving right in and ready to do it. So uh, the dates. What are the dates for this year's water festival? This year we're going to be July 16th through July 25th. Okay. And are we looking at a lot of safety protocols in place? You worked very closely with the city of Buford to make sure everyone is, is safe because of COVID. You were canceled last year, but you're back. But we're back. We uh, Once the governor lifted the order, um, immediate phone calls and conversations were made with the leadership of the city. Mm -hmm. And you know, there's been some great dialogue between the city leaders and, and the Buford Water Festival. And through our partnerships with the city, we've been able to come up with a safe plan to make sure that, that everybody that's down there is safe, both the patrons and, and our staff, um, right. you know, to, to try to make sure that we can put on this event for Beaufort and bring everybody back together again. Yep. Now, volunteerism is huge through for the Water Festival. There's so many opportunities to be a volunteer. So go ahead, I know we'll have it on the screen, but the, the website, if you want to be involved, if you want to sponsor, volunteer, if you want a ticket, how do we kind of, we're still in the early early stages of all this, this is April, so what are some of the, you know, where can we go to get all that information? Absolutely. If you go to www.bftwaterfestival.com, okay. uh, there's information on there on how to become a sponsor. Uh, we love working with our sponsors, uh, our partners. They're, without their help and support, there's absolutely no way that this could be done for the community. Um, you mentioned our, our volunteers. Uh, you know, we, we're like a small army. We're a water festival army when we get down Isn't there. Is it like 200 or something it, like it's that? It's in the hundreds. Yeah. And it could right. not be done without the, the support of all the volunteers. You know, right. everybody that's down there, up to and including myself, we don't make anything for this. This is We just do this for the love of our community and to, and to make sure that this event continues on for our children and our grandchildren. Um, but, you know, go online, by all means, uh, submit a volunteer application. We'll find something. You know, there's always <laughs> something that needs to be carried or done. I'm sure there, there's plenty of jobs. And I know, Tank, there are uh, contracts to be signed and so forth and so on. But at this point, just generally, will there be any concerts? Will there be, just give me some, or give us some highlights of uh, the week. Well, we I can could. tell you that, you know, opening ceremonies, we're still on track. Good. Uh, concert in the park, the contracts are being finalized as we speak. Um, we're working on those very closely with our, uh, with our representatives. And, uh, you know, I'm hopeful <laughs> that uh, the other events will continue on uh, as normal. You know, personally, I absolutely love Motown Monday myself. Um, so, you know, Reggie D's and D's guys come down there and they put on a fabulous show every year and, and we're so glad to have them back again and looking forward to all of our wonderful events that continue to go on you know we also have children's day mm -hmm. um all these other daily events that are going on on the weekends the air show um the raft races the, you know we're just we're ready to get ready out to there get, and do all this i know it i know so you are the Commodore and you also are a training officer with the Buford Sheriff's Office. Correct. How much time does it take to be the, 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 the chief, if you will, of the Buford Water Festival and have your regular job? The, the Buford Water Festival is like a part-time job in itself. I know, itself. that's what I was thinking. Um, you know, I probably put in at least 15 hours, 20 hours a week, wow. just in uh, emails Mails when I get calls. home and phone calls and uh, meetings. You know, we're, we're constantly doing things and we're always constantly trying to stay with the times and make sure that we're doing the things that the community wants to see out there. And, you know, we're, we love to get feedback from the community mm -hmm. and continue to, you know, look at this stuff and do everything that we can to, to be there. Is the Water Festival an opportunity to attract a lot of tourists? Well, I know it's for the locals too, in this in the Low Country. Mm -hmm. But do we get a lot of tourists coming in from other parts of the oh, yeah. state or the? Oh yeah, absolutely. The nation? I mean, we've you know we've had people come in as far as that I know of uh, personally from Tennessee. I mean, just you know, a lot of people get online and they see this event and they see everything that we're about, and they just love to come down and, and be part of be part of Beaufort and help us celebrate our wonderful area. I know. And so again, it's back for 2021 and the dates again are? July 16th through the 25th. 16th through the 25th. Thank you, Commodore Tank Morris. Appreciate you being with us. Thanks for letting me come back. And thank you all for watching North of the Broad and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.